instead of a week to break them in, I just need 5 minutes every time to do this. You need a pair of shoes, flats, heels, whatever you're trying to stretch out, a thick pair of socks. My favorite hair dryer and if you don't have one, make sure to check below for a huge discount so you can get one. And also yourself, well, your feet. Your feet going to do most of the work. Before we get started, here are some tips to keep your feet from getting sweaty and smelly. Deodorant, it helps absorb odor and keep your feet dry. Make sure to rub it in between your toes and the bottom of your feet. If you want to learn how to make your own, make sure to check at the end of the video how to make your own natural deodorant. And also, if you wear flat shoes, it's good to wear flat socks inside or they're called footsie too so you can keep your feet staying warm and dry. It's time to break them in. Wear your thick socks and you're going to practice wiggling your toes up and down. Flexing your toes will help stretch out the leather or any type of other shoe fabric that you have. I slide my shoes back on and definitely not the most fashionable look or comfortable because it's snug tight in there with those thick socks. Now you're going to take your hair dryer and set it on medium heat. This hair dryer from Numi, it's so amazing because it dries my hair so quick that it makes me want to do my hair more often. And for that, I had to take advantage of the discount and give one away. So make sure to check the link below on how to enter too. So you're going to wiggle your toes up and down as you heat your toes. You can also heat the heel of your toes too for extra stretching. And once you're done, you're going to let it cool down. It's like a little workout, so make sure to do a little dance while you're at it. I'm taking off my thick pair of socks off just to see how much space I have inside my shoes and yes, I have so much space. And if you need more toe space, just repeat these steps. Heat, wiggle, and dance. Now you know how to break in your shoes in under 5 minutes without torturing your feet. I hope you guys like these tips and please be inspired.